Yo, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're talking about Petr Jan versus Song Yadong. Petr Jan's one in four in his last five fights. It has to be stated that he hasn't. You know, he he lost the uh, title against Aljamain Sterling with the legal knee. Uh, beat Corey Sanhagen decisively, and then lost to Sterling in the split decision. I I thought Jan won. Uh, he lost to Sean O'Malley. I thought he won, and then lost to Marab Davalos. Really, where he didn't look bad, he just got overwhelmed by the crazy output that is Marab. Uh, minus one forty favorite. I agree. Thirty one years old, five seven with a sixty seven inch reach. Fighting Song Yudong, who's twenty one and seven, twenty one seven and one. He's 4-1 in his last five fights. The one loss is against Corey Sandhagen, which was a doctor stoppage. Corey scraped by the skin of his teeth on that one. 26 years old, 5'8", with a 67-inch reach, 1 inch in height for Song Yudong. I like Petr Yan in this one. I think his boxing's better. I think the one-punch power is better on Song Yudong. But Petr Yan just puts everything together better. I mean, he's the better combination puncher. He's the better uh, body puncher, head puncher. He's better with leg kicks. He's better with pressure, better blocking. The only thing that Song Yudong is better at is the one-punch power. That's it. You look at it. Strikes landed per minutes, 5.03 to 4.38. Accuracy is 53 to 42. Strikes absorbed per minutes, 4.26 to 3.73. Defense is 59 to 57. Takedowns. For a fight, it's 1.71 to 0.63, 52 to 58 accuracy. Takedown defense is 85 to 73, 85, and he just got done fighting Marab Devalish, really. It's still 85% to 73, very little submission offerings, offerings in this one. I like Jan. I think Jan does very, very well in this matchup. Again, he's the better puncher. He's the better combination uh, fighter, better striker. It's just the power that Song Yudong has over Petr Jan. That's it. And he's fought the better competition. I mean, Song Yudong skated by in the fight against uh, Cheeto Vera. He's 10-2-1 in the UFC. D uh, Dom uh, destroyed Ricky Simone in the fifth round. Chris Gutierrez, he beat. I thought Chris Gutierrez won. Not going to lie. I don't see how uh, Song Yudong won. I thought Song won the fourth and fifth round when he took him down. But I had Chris clearly winning rounds one, two, and three. Um, or, yeah, I had I had Chris winning three rounds. He beat Marlon Marais, who was getting knocked out by everybody. Beat Julio Arce, which is a pretty good win. I'll give you that. Beat Casey Kenny by split decision. Go back and watch that fight. Um Lost to Kyler Phillips, like I said. Beat Marlon Vera, where he did not beat Marlon Vera. Uh, draw against Cody Stamen. And destroyed Alejandro Perez, where we actually haven't seen Alejandro Perez in quite some time. 2022 against Jonathan Martinez. Maybe he was released. I don't know. But yeah. I, I like Song. I like Song. I mean, Jesus Christ. I like. I see it at the top right of my top left of my freaking screen i like petter yang on this one i think he does good i think he wins he might even finish song yudong hot take hot take sorry not sorry petter yang will win this fight as always subscribe like comment let me know who you guys are picking peace